Hey guys, I don't know how the stream is, so I'm trying again. I tried earlier, but I wanted to jump on real quick. I'm waiting to see if someone can tell me if the stream is okay, because if not, I'll just do this later. Um, so we'll see. I'm waiting one second. Um, this, I wanted to come on. Obviously, this is not planned. I'm in the middle of nowhere, driving home, and um, what prompted me to come on is that I, uh, a lot of messages that I've been getting, and I just wanted to address it because it's stressing me out. Um, so let me know if you if the stream is okay because really I don't want to have to remake this and redo it and re talk about it again. So let me know. I'm waiting for a chat to pop up. It's yeah, I'm okay. Does the stream look okay? I'm doing okay, but I just wanted to address something real quick um, and hopefully put it to bed again. Um, but I'm waiting to see if y'all could tell me if the stream looks okay. Oh, thanks, Joni. Does it look okay? Okay, good. Okay, so basically, um, I really thought this, this whole situation was over, and I'm really not trying to drag anything back out, um, but what is, what's been happening is, if you have been following a little bit, you know, there was an issue with a design that was taken, um, anyway, and this is not to do necessarily with that particular thing at all, well, sort of, but, um, the, the thing is, that it opened like a whole can of worms and it's part of the reason that I was taking a little bit of a break too as a step back because I thought it would kind of um, put some distance but when I created the well first I did merch talk with the guys talking about the design issue that happened um, and then I put out a video sharing names and details and everything um, and took it down because an apology was made and I get people make mistakes and and, and all of that and so I took the video down and I explained, you know, did a video explaining why I took the video down. The reason I'm making this one today is that I, from the moment I made the first video, um, I've gotten so many emails, private messages, comments, comments that are public comments, um, about situations and it was almost, and, and I know when I created the video explaining everything, I was like, I'm trying, the reason I'm doing this is I'm putting myself in the position of what if it was my sister who doesn't have a YouTube channel, who doesn't have a Facebook group or a Facebook presence or whatever it is that can't say, this happened to me, this happened to me, oh yeah, this happened to me. Because in our industry, in our, there isn't a higher authority, there isn't somebody that you go to and say, this person whether it's the people that are involved with me or not you know that there is not an entity that we as resellers or designers or creators can go to and say this particular person whether it's what would happen with me or not um, this per this particular person or company or this you know did this thing to me they you know however you may f feel you were wronged um, and so I feel like when I made that video it kind of opened the door where it was like oh, okay now Margaret you're the person that we're gonna go to and I have brought s at least one of the concerns that have come to me to the people involved um, and I didn't get a satisfactory response but whatever but that but that just kind of opened it up to you know I mean, from the moment that it happened, like I said, I, I was getting 15 to 20 messages, emails, comments a day, and it hasn't stopped. I mean, it's trickled down to where I get between three and five messages a day, and I'm happy to hear it, and I, I feel like sometimes people are just messaging me because they want a voice. They want to say, this happened to me, you know, and what do I, what can be done? I've had people saying, Margaret, don't drop this because, and, and I'm just like, I just want to say, I can't be that person. You know, I'm, I wish there was a platform or a higher authority, um, you know, that could be, could be that. Um, and maybe that's something, and again, I, I, I'm saying, I wish I could be that person, but I can't. Um, I can't, you know, because I'm like, oh, you know, maybe there could be a group where people can go and voice, because that was one of the things too. There was an apology made to me, and I really appreciated it. And then comments that people had made in that thread were deleted, and then so I was getting messages from outraged people that had something to say about it, who felt like they were muzzled. And so I get that. I get that that feeling like. 
I'm lucky that I am able to come and say this happened. But people that just make comments saying, hey, something like this happened to me too. Um, their, their comments were deleted and they don't have like a place to go and say, not cool, man. <laughs> you know, that's not right. Um, and, and I do get, so I messaged about something that just happened recently. You know, one of the comments I got, I messaged the people involved and said, look guys, this, um, this was a comment I got from somebody, blah, 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 blah. Um, and the response I got was, hey, Margaret, be careful that you're not being roped into drama that doesn't exist. And my response was, and I know you can't read tone over messages, but my response was the, the drama exists. It, acts, it, it absolutely exists. I'm getting messages and emails and comments every day. So it's not, and I get it if it was like a handful of people that I never heard of messaging me, trying to stir, stir the pot. It's people that have watched me, commented, messaged me for years. You know, it's some people, yeah, they're saying I'm buying into the drama or I don't know if you're saying that I'm saying that. I'm not, I'm not trying to buy into any drama. I'm just saying that that's what they were t telling me like oh you're 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 helping stir up the drama but i'm just saying there have been so many emails and messages that i've gotten from people that are not even just to do with with this but but prior stuff um so i'm just saying i appreciate the trust that people are sending me messages about this i appreciate it and i wish i could and it, it feels like people are wanting me to do be the person to go like lead the charge and I'm just not gonna be that person I wish I could be but it feels like there are enough people that are having issues that there I wish there was a place that everybody could go and talk about it I wish there was and I wish I could create that place but I can't um, so I think Deb was, I can't, I don't know how to get back to the messages. Um, where does it say? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, um, yeah, it says it feels horrible to be run over with someone with clout. And I think that's the, that's the lot of the, the tone of the messages that I'm getting are just like people saying, I tried to comment. I tried to use my voice and I was, I was deleted. My comment was deleted. I was deleted. My problem was deleted. And I feel that pain. I get that. Um, so anyway, I just want to say, while I appreciate the messages and emails and things, and I, and I, and I think I have responded to everybody, um, I just wanted to say, like, I can't be that person for everybody. I'm glad that I said something because it did kind of open up a discussion that maybe needs to be had in our community. Um, whether it's to do with people that I had an issue with and again there were apologies people make mistakes you know and and that was something that you know we worked out that the apology was made and I'm hoping I, I hear what you're saying Deb yeah and, and I and it's hard I, I've made mistakes I I you know I've tried ventures that didn't work out I you know I tried patreon I still have a patreon but when things don't work out you know I'm super transparent and say my kids are here playing um, we're on the road but I was it, it was stressing me out to the point where I was like I need to just get it off my chest and say it because I do it I mean I got three messages already today you know and I had four or five yesterday um, so it's not gone you know I know and people are coming to me with it but I can't do anything about it. I wish I could do something about it. I wish there was a place for people to go or uh, somebody more, th you know, cause it feels like it's, it's that or it's the law, you know? And it's like, some people don't want to go, you know, make it the law and they don't want to be just like the one guy, the one person that had the problem. Cause that's how it starts feeling. But the more messages I get, it's like, I don't know. So this is just an open question, an open problem that our community has is that there's not checks and balances and people feeling like they're having a voice when they're, 
And I get that there are people that want to stir the pot. I get that there are people that want, I get there are people that despise certain people in our community. Um, and would love to take them down and would love to see that, you know, just like whatever. I, um, but it's, I mean, that's not me. I get it. Like everybody's trying to support their families. Everybody's trying and hopefully do it in a honest, respectable way and not trying to screw people over and all of that good stuff. Um, and whether it's a mistake or a miscalculation or a misjudgment or, a, you know, as long as the, as long as you're transparent about stuff, you know, and say, dude, I made a mistake. Let me make it right. That's, I mean, I think that's all that most people want. I mean, yeah, there are people that are out there that want vengeance. I'm not a vengeance person generally. I, uh, generally, I say. Um, so yeah. Anyway, so that was basically it. Um, cause it's been weighing on me with all the messages and me feeling like I should be doing something about it, but I can't. I, I do have a lot on my plate. Um, what we need is an intellectual property attorney who would allow concierge type services merch creator, right? That would, that would be cool. You know? Yeah. Or even just cause, cause there are creators who hate that other people charge for their services. I'm not one of those people. There, there are resellers that charge for courses. There are, you know, there are people that create courses and books and, and have groups that are paid. And I am so okay with that. What I don't like is when people feel like they've been screwed and when people feel like they've been duped and they don't have a place to go. They don't have somebody to go, you know, other, you know what I mean? I don't know. You know what I'm, I I think you get what I'm saying is it's, I mean, and, and you know, I've got friends. I personally have had a paid group. We, we made it unpaid because just life in my life. And I explained it and that it was as open and honest as I could be and refunded money on the last month and all of this stuff, you know, it just, I don't know. I feel like, you know, I, I'm okay. I'm okay with people trying to make money and sell their services if they've got a service to sell, mm -hmm. but I don't know. I don't even know what I'm trying to say now, but I think you get, I think you get what I'm trying to say. Um, so this is not me coming on trying to bash everybody or pull things back out. It's just me saying to the people that are messaging me, I can't be the police of the land. Of the of the reseller merch land, <laughs> you know. Um, but I again wish there was a platform or a, some sort of organized something that could help. That could help, you know, like a better business bureau for the merch slash reseller community that people could go to and say who who are reputable. Or who has dings against them? Or is there some sort of checks and balances? Or, you know, I know people will fake things and say fake things happen that didn't really happen. And uh, this is my dreamland, apparently, that there was, you know, this idyllic whatever. Anyway. Okay. So that's it. I uh, thank you so much. Yeah. Um, and obviously, I was not intending to make this because we are in the middle of nowhere driving home. And it was just something that was weighing on me and seeing... A couple more messages come in to me today um, which I'll get back to you if it was you I'll, I'll, I'll message you but it would be nice if there was a place that people could go you know yeah integrity absolutely so the buyer beware what is that Latin phrase <laughs> anyway um, you can only control your personal space. I'm going to have to come back and read a lot. I know there were a lot of comments that came through, um, and I'll have to come back and read them. So, I hope that the tone of this was coming across correctly. Um, I hope that everybody understands that I'm not trying to pull things out or drag things out, but that I feel you, I hear you, and... Um, I wish that there was a place that everybody who felt like their voice was being stifled or that they were being muzzled or that they were being deleted could go and just vent, you know, and, and you know what, if you need to send me that message and just put that at the top, this is just me venting. I needed to get it out. I need to be heard. I think that, I mean, a lot of people, that's just their thing. It's like, 
Let me be heard. I feel screwed and I, whatever, I need to be heard. So, you know, thank you for that super chat. It came through and I missed who, who sent it. Oh, Connie, thank you so much. Um, so yeah, if, if, if that's what you need, then just put that at the top and I might just send you a thumbs up because sometimes I've, you know, I've got two boys, I'm homeschooling, I'm trying to move, blah, 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 everything. Just at the top. This is just me venting. I want to be heard and I will, I hear you. Okay. Okay. Thanks you guys. Um, and I will talk to you later. Okay. Put that on a shirt. I need to be heard. Hear me or else suffer the consequences. No. Okay. Thanks you guys. Oh, I love you too, Rose. Thank you guys. Hearts, hearts. Thank you everybody. And I will talk to you later. Thanks for hearing me. Thank you. I don't know how to stop this though. Okay. Again, thanks you guys. And hopefully this all came across the right way or the way I intended it anyway. Okay. Bye everybody.